reviewing Papi Chulo's in Royal Palm Beach, Florida. Papi Chulo! That's my name. This place is said to be goaded when it comes to tacos and everything else. Let's see what it's hitting on. These are the Mexican donuts. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Let's just say that came off the aluminum foil, shall we? Even though it's blue. So these, in all honesty, they suck. So these are Mexican donuts. And I feel like these are like churro donuts. It's supposed to have cinnamon sugar. I taste the sugar, but when it comes to the cinnamon, can not taste that motherfucker at all. This is the leche condensada. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong, but. Ooh. Uh, maybe this is some type of, some type of glaze. Not really sure what they were trying to achieve here, but nah. Nah, you ain't no poppy doing shit like this. This is the chicken burrito. Also one of the best selling items. Nah, ain't no way in hell this is one of the best selling items. Ain't no way. So we got chicken, rice, cheese, and beans inside this mug. And when I tell you there's not an ounce of flavor coming from anything inside this burrito, please believe me, because I mean it. This is, uh, you know, this is really pathetic. Let me try this again. I feel believe this is, yes. It sucks. It sucks bad. Next, we try on tacos. This is barbacoa. No. So they give you a lot of barbacoa, right? I mean, they stuff this thing down with barbacoa, amongst other items. Onions, queso fresco, cilantro, chili sauce, avocado. The brisket ain't bad, for damn sure ain't smoke. It's supposed to have chili inside this mug. Let me just taste this one more time to make sure I ain't tripping. Nah, bro. Visually, this looks amazing. But when you stick in your mouth, your taste buds is gonna be ready to beat your ass. So this is just, this is horrible. Black and Baja fish. Okay, this one's pretty good. So it has black and fish, which is most definitely seasoned. And then it has onions, pineapple, and cilantro. When you bite into this, you're gonna get most of the flavor from the pineapples and also the chipotle mayo. Chipotle mayo is most definitely hidden. Mexican street corn. Nope. How are you Mexican and can't fix tacos and corn? I don't understand that. So you can get the street corn either on the cob, off the cob. I got it off the cob. It's supposed to have cotilla cheese, chipotle mayo, and cilantro in here. I see the cilantro, I see the cotilla cheese, but I don't quite see the chipotle mayo. Oh, I'll take that back, I do see it. But it ain't no way in hell this is chipotle mayo. This is chipotle midio. I don't know what the hell y'all doing back there, but it needs to, it needs to stop. You gave me a line, although I don't deserve it, Ain't no saving this. North Carolina don't do a lot of things right, but what we can do, we can fix some tacos. I know the review is supposed to be over, but uh, I went back and got some more donuts because of that little blue strand of bullshit. These are a hell of a lot better. I can actually taste the cinnamon and the sugar on these, and they're hot and fresh. I'll change my score for these. If you're in the Royal Palm Beach area, check this place out.